Uh, my name is Lofty Polam. Um, I'm a single mom with six children. And um, I'm in a um, nursing program. I'm also a petition. And I live at um, Georgetown Community. I was introduced to ASA by this lady called Efreda because I was hit by COVID. So I lost my job. So then I called her and asked her if I could get you know, resources for her rent. Then she referred me to this lady called Fatu and Fatu work with ASA. They actually came um, to my community and they started to help us fill up the rental assistance form because we, we didn't even know the website, we didn't know how to you know, uh, um, navigate for help out there. So they were the one that already came uh, at that time, we already needed help. When they engaged me on this and said, we can work along with you, you know, and my fellow community members handpicked me and said they wanted me to go to represent Georgetown. That was how I began to work from house to house. I began to share flyers. I was able to share close to like 80 from like 50% of this community benefited from is at work. Like it was not just me had a rental, you know, problem, you know. We had other people that was facing the same problem that I was facing because the pandemic was hit by a lot of people. And we had an issue with our landlord. They, initially, they were saying they couldn't repair our place because we signed up, we signed up, maybe we didn't repair that. We're entering our old apartment. But according to it, that it's not supposed to be so. They were going against the government and law, you know. So so that was how they, they brought the, 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 the maintenance form and we filled out the maintenance form. We submitted the email to our landlords. So our landlords started coming and repairing most of those commodes and most of those things that were damaged. So that was how it, it have impacted us as a community.